It's the 9th of February, I'm Jerusha Sukthia Rath and here are today's headlines. ESCOM has confirmed there'll be a 50% chance of load shedding today. This comes after a weekend of stage 2 load shedding across the country. Now the power utility tweeted, any unexpected changes on an already constrained power system could result in load shedding. ESCOM ended stage 2 of rolling power cuts just after 10pm last night and the power utility confirmed that Kuburg Power Station's Unit 1 will shut down from today for scheduled refueling, inspection and maintenance. The unit is expected to be back in order at the end of May. Over the weekend, evidence has emerged that Henry van Breda, he's the 20-year-old survivor of the Stellenbosch axe attack, only called emergency services four hours after the attack took place. This all according to the Sunday Times. The paper also reported that his injuries were self-inflicted. Now Henry's parents and older brother were killed in the incident. His younger sister Madly sustained critical injuries and is in hospital under constant police guard. She has reportedly regained consciousness and is able to answer simple questions like who are you and what year is it? And finally, speaking at a press lunch at the presidential guest house in Pretoria yesterday, President Jacob Zuma called the EFF's behaviour in Parliament unacceptable. Zuma said the EFF's choice of overalls in Parliament was an insult to workers who had to wear those overalls every day. He of course said that South Africans who voted for the EFF should regret their decision and decide not to cast any more votes for the economic freedom fighters in the future. Stay tuned to News 24 Live, we'll be bringing you these stories and more.